it yourself. DIY edible slime! Yes, we are taking just household kitchen things, groceries, whatever. Just food, anything you can eat, and we're turning it into slime. Delicious, yummy slime. Yes. So what um, I'm gonna make is um, vanilla slime, so vanilla pudding slime. Ooh. And my favorite, gummy bears, ah. but yes. slime version. All right. <laughs> I am gonna make some awesome Nutella slime. Ooh. Oh yeah. And I'm also gonna make some Starburst slime. Ooh. Sweet. Yeah, so we have four different types of edible slime we're gonna make, and then at the end, we want you guys to vote for your favorite. Mm -hmm. You ready to get started? I totally am. Let's do it. <laughs> all right, guys, to make your gummy bear slime, all you'll need are some gummy bears, obviously, some cornstarch and powdered sugar. All you'll need is a cup of gummy bears of your choice, um, which in my case are the red ones. Um, so I'm gonna put them in here. But yeah, you can choose whatever gummy bears you want. So I'm gonna put them in a separate bowl. And then in another bowl, I'm gonna take two tablespoons of cornstarch. And then some powdered sugar. Yummy! So I'm gonna set this to the side while I microwave these babies. So I'm probably gonna leave them in the microwave for about 15 seconds or so, but you can always take them out and stir and repeat as necessary until um, you get the consistency that you want. The goal is to get something nice and gooey um, so that I can mix it in with this, make it pliable and have fun with my gummy bear slime. All right, gummy bears, now you're working with me. So instead of 15 seconds, it was more like a minute. Uh, but anyway, once it's uh, gotten to this consistency, um, you're gonna add in your mix of powdered sugar and cornstarch. So I'm just gonna add a little at a time, probably a uh, tablespoon of the mix at a time. The colors are changing a little bit. All right guys, I'm going in with my hands. Let's let's test this out and see if it's actually like <gasps> chocolatey dream slime. So what you need is Nutella and marshmallows, and that's it, and some math skills. Because for every tablespoon of Nutella you use, you need three marshmallows. So I'm gonna use a cup. There are 16 tablespoons in a cup. So you're gonna take three times 16, 48. That's right, people. I can do math sometimes. Okay, so I'm gonna take 48 little marshmallows. Put them in this bowl. Forty-eight. Woo! Okay, so you heat this up in the microwave, and same thing with Fia's. You want to go a little bit at a time. So I'm gonna go in ten-second intervals until it gets to that nice little creamy sauce I need. Oh my gosh! Okay, so I heat them up in the microwave, and they turned massive. So I'm gonna stir them around a little bit. Now I need one cup of Nutella. Oh yeah, this is the good stuff. So I'm just gonna measure it out. Whoa, this is already kind of slimy itself, so you can see where it gets the gooiness. All right, so that's about a cup. You put that with your marshmallows. This looks like a dessert in itself. You don't want to 
waste Nutella. That's just like a no-no in my book. You need to save every last little drop. It needs to be used somehow. I don't care how you use it. Okay. And we just mix this up. Ooh, yeah. It looks like kind of a weird mousse. Not like the animal mousse. There's like a food type of mousse. But it is brown, so it's kind of like a mousse too. Oh my gosh, this stuff is so sticky. Ah! This is crazy. Okay, so I'm gonna pick it up. And I'm just gonna play with it. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. It's slime that I can eat. I'm gonna eat it right now. Oh my gosh, that's so good. So there is some Nutella slime. What are you making now, Thea? Oh my goodness, that Nutella slime looks so good. All right, Lindsay, I'm gonna make you something that will probably go well with that Nutella, and that is pudding slime. Vanilla pudding slime, that is. And for this, all you're gonna need is some water, your pudding mix, um, and some cornstarch. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pour a fourth of a cup of my pudding mix into my pretty blue bowl over here. Mm, oh my gosh, you guys, that smells so good. Looks like fake snow. All right, I'm gonna pour that in there. And then I'm gonna take a cup of cornstarch. So I'm gonna add it in little by little. Probably gonna put half of it in first. All right, I've got my handy dandy spoon for mixing. And then I warmed this measuring um, pitcher of water and I'm gonna pour about a third of a cup. And then I'm gonna pour it in just like so. Again, little by little. Now it's mixing. Mmm, smells so delicious. That's why you guys are gonna have to try this recipe to smell it for yourselves because it smells amazing. All right, now I'm gonna add the remaining half a cup of cornstarch. Let's see. I get that. All right. I'm gonna get my hands in there and see how pliable this thing is. Ooh. Wow, it's just like vanilla slime. Oh my goodness, look at that, you guys. Whoa, it looks awesome. Ah, so happy about this. Turned out great. All right, let's see if it tastes just as great. Mmm, this is so, so good. It's so vanilla -y and so sweet and so mm, delicious and slimy. And the best part, you can play with it and shape it however you want. All right, Miss Lindsay, back to you. Oh, I see your pudding game there, Thea. That looks really good, but I'm gonna raise the bar and do some Starburst slime. That's right. So I picked out all the pink ones from this bag and I unwrapped them. Pink is my favorite color of Starburst. What is your favorite color? Let me know in the comments. And I'm gonna put them all in this big bowl here. Okay, and then secondly, we need powdered sugar and cornstarch. So we need a fourth a cup of each. Just like so, put them in here. In a separate bowl. Oh yeah. Okay, so we're gonna mix this up. And then I'm going to heat these in the microwave. Same deal, we're gonna go 10 seconds at a time until they're nice and gooey. Oh my goodness, you guys, this smells so good. This is like a strawberry dream. Look at that. So good. Okay, so we're gonna add a little bit of this in at a time. Couple scoops. And we mix it up. Mix it up. Now we may not actually use the whole amount of this because this is actually for a whole amount of Starburst bags. So we have four other, three other colors we could use. Ooh, yeah. Okay, so right now it's got a little bit of powder on the outside, but you just work it in, work it in. And you have Starburst slime. Oh, it's so good. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is so awesome. Yay. And they smell so good. Mm. And you can eat them. That's crazy. Okay, so we want to know which one was your
your favorite. We need you guys to vote in the comments. Do you like Starburst, Nutella, pudding, or gummy bear? Which is your favorite? Let us know in the comments below. Yes, and press that like button if you want us to do more slime videos. Ah, yeah. <laughs> Thanks Bye. so much for watching. Bye.